What's up guys? Welcome back. Welcome back to another video on Naruto Ultimate Ninja Blazing and what we're doing today is You know, there's nothing new to be honest. I mean, there's some price adjustment. It looks like I really you know, I really dislike the price adjustment, but whatever India Turkey All right, so what we're gonna do today in this video, there's nothing really happening I think it's because they came up with ninja voltage the the you know the other game and I'm not really into the other game. I mean, I have to give up. I can't play every game. I mean, there's the console games. I like those Digimon games. And then, you know, I can't play every game. So I got to pick and choose. If I play the Ninja Voltage, I have to give up on this game. But I don't like how they're not updating the game as much anymore. Let me just go on over here. I'll show you guys what's happening. I mean, there, there's, you know, they just re, they're just redoing the thing. And now... I did, you know, they had the, not the granny cat point, but the other granny point. Or what we got from the summon, right? I didn't even use it. And it expired. Which is unfortunate, but what can you do? So anyways, there's nothing really happening in the game right now, unfortunately. I, I don't know if they're letting it go. I don't know if, you know, it, it, I can't play both games. Because it takes too much time, it takes too much effort, and it takes too much money. Now... I don't know. I guess we'll we'll get Mara up there today in this video, and you know this is the Blazing Awakening. Now you know Mara. He'll turn from Path of Dreams into, I guess, more of the adult version with his armor and everything. Proof of Dreams. I mean, Path of Dreams Awakened. All right. So here it is. I like it. it looks cool. And it requires these things. We're gonna awaken it. Blazing Awakening. Bam! There we go. And he becomes extremely, extremely powerful. Except he costs 80. Oh my gosh. That's expensive. You know, I thought the, the other one was expensive. But this one costs 80. So that, that's a lot more expensive. Now you could turn back if you choose to do so. You could do that. Which is not the red star. Right? So we're in the red star mode. And I don't know, uh, I liked it, but it, it's just a lot more expensive to, how should I say it? Use, right? It, it costs 80, which is not cheap. And this mod right here costs 80 too, which is not cheap too. I'm going to go on in here, I guess I'm going to replace him. I think that mod is red, right? It's fire. Or not. If he's not fire, then I have to choose somebody else. Alright, so like I was saying, I have no clue what's happening in this game. Because they're not updating it as much anymore. I mean, they came out with the Ninja Clash and everything. That's cool. But, you know, I was hoping that they would update it some more. Alright, so it's green. I'm gonna put, the, put it in here. Perfect! 219. So, I'm gonna use the green team. And what we're going to do is, I, I guess we might as well play the emergency mission or let, let's get some ramen. I'm hungry. I am hungry! Anyways, let's go on in here. Uh, let's choose him. And here it is. Yo, my green characters weren't so good anyway, so I guess this is good. But like I was saying, you know, they're not updating the game as much and I haven't logged into the other Naruto game. Because I, I don't know. I mean, if I play that game, I can't play this game. Because I have a, a whole bunch of Marvel game and DC games that I, you know. Wow. Okay, let's take out this guy. And then what we're going to do is... I think he he's going to... He counters. I could be wrong, though. I don't remember. Oh, really? Alright, so I have no choice because he's hitting my Madara. And he costs 4 right now, so that's okay. 4 is not bad, actually. 4 is pretty good. I mean, I wish he cost 3, but I don't think that's ever happening. 
All right, here we go. One big square. All right, so that's the perfect form, Susanu. All right, let's see where he's going to go. Oh, he counters. All right, this is a single attack, and it pushes the enemy back. Uchiha Reflection! All right, so those are the two attacks. Unfortunately, he didn't have any special animation. I mean... The animation was very generic. It, something just flew by. That's about it. I was hoping for something more, but there wasn't any of that. And it looks like we're running into a bit of problems here with the, these red enemies. Which looks like they're pretty strong. See, they, he has that sort of animation, which is not, you know, not that good. Uh, I don't want to do that. Man! I can't believe we're struggling here. Well, I guess this is a 50 level. But you notice he has small range. I'm a, I like characters with larger range in this. All right, here we go again. Perfect form, Susano. Oh my God, the real boss was up there all along. See, at least this one has animation. You notice that, right? And our Blazing Awakened Madara don't have that. Which is very strange. Alright, that's it for now. We'll be back in the next video on Naruto Ultimate Ninja Blazing. I'm still debating if I should, you know, play this one or play the other one. Because you can't play both. And this one isn't updating that much. Which is really bad because if I, you know... If it's not updating that much, why would I want to buy Ninja Pearls? Right? I mean, I have a bunch of strong characters in this game. I really do. I don't want to give it up because... You know, once you get to a certain point, you're like, Damn! You have so many strong characters, now you're, you're giving up? That's bad! And seriously, that, that would be bad. But anyways, that's it for now. We'll be back next time as we continue on in Naruto Ultimate Ninja Blazing. Be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel. Let me know which one. And of course, what do you think about the Digimon game and Dragon Ball game? Let me know in the comment section below. I'll see you guys in the next video.